In this chapter, you will learn how you can quickly and easily program your tasks with the programming language SCL. To do so, you have the graphical programming languages LAD and FBD at your disposal. In principle, you can use them to solve all automation tasks. You also have the option of the high-level language SCL, which is especially well-suited for data management or for more sophisticated calculations, such as calculating an arithmetic mean. For these tasks, in particular, SEL offers also the language elements common to other high-level languages, such as program loops or conditional statements. In this, the programming of SEL blocks is normally easier and more clearly arranged than with the graphical programming languages. And in the instructions task card in the TIA portal, as in all other programming languages, you'll also find many other code building blocks and templates to make programming easier. SEL also offers numerous functions that facilitate your handling of program code and help you in terms of legibility. If you don't have any access to the current project, in case servicing is required, you can even load the entire SEL program from the controller of your plant onto a programming device. Naturally, as with SEL, you can also monitor the variables used during operation. That helps on troubleshooting and debugging. So, what does that look like in the TIA portal? Let us take a look at it using programming with SEL language elements as an example. Let us say you want to calculate the arithmetic mean of the last current values. To do so, you first create an SEL block, for example, a function, or FC for short. In the block interface of the FC, you define the variables that you need in the program component. The values for determining the arithmetic mean are stored in an array. The product is shown as a result value of the function. For a better overview in the program section, you can organize your SEL code into areas called regions. These areas are comparable with networks in LAD and FBD and can be opened and closed as needed. You can go to each of the individual regions very easily via the area overview. You enter the SEL instructions either from the instructions task card in your program or via the favorites. With the IF instruction in SEL, you can have the program section called up conditionally. The editor adds the full syntax of the instruction. Now all you have to do is replace the wildcard with a condition. IntelliSense supports you in variable selection. Alternatively, you can also enter the SEL instructions manually. In order to calculate the mean value, all the values of the array first have to be added up. It is very easy with a for loop. Finally, you assign calculated arithmetic mean to the output value. In this, the program editor already tests the syntax during input. Errors are recognized immediately and can be remedied right away. In order to improve the overview of your program, you can automatically format entire code sections. Associated code sections can be expanded and collapsed. Associated objects are marked automatically. This applies to both keywords and to variables. There are bookmarks in order to quickly navigate within larger blocks. The programming of the function block is now complete. As you can see, with the programming language FBD, your program for the same task would have been significantly larger. Now the SEL block simply has to be called up in an additional module. By the way, you can also insert arithmetic expressions or algorithms that can be more clearly arranged in SEL 
as an SEL network directly into an LAD or FBD block. Thus, depending upon your preference, various programming languages can be combined within one function block. The program can now be loaded into the controller and tested. Naturally, you can also monitor the program status of the SEL program online. This considerably helps you identify and rectify faults. With the programming language SEL, you can use traditional high-level language elements. This enables you to program complex algorithms. The integrated online functions guide you through commissioning and troubleshooting. 